What is going on guys? It's your boy Apti back with a brand new video and today we're going to be using the no recoil mini Uzi. This thing is a beam as you can see and this gun is amazing because the Uzi is a beast from the east. Hit him that's on its flank right here. And I actually love this class because it literally feels like an AR from range. This thing can beam so far away. Um, obviously, it has really good damage. The Uzi is pretty absurd. And it feels like a mini AR. No recoil, just roaming around the map. Absolute beaming some kids. They're probably just going back and forth. They can, it's killing them one by one. And funny story, you know how there's like supposed to be this big update maybe in two, three, four weeks? I'm not sure when it's coming, but it's supposed to be this big update where they nerf the growl. Uh, they're going to nerf other guns. Look at that beam. Holy shit. And, um, you know, I really feel like they're going to nerf the MP5. Damn. So, you know, I've mentioned it before. Pro players have been using the Mini Uzi a bit. And I can easily see the Mini Uzi. Like, if the MP5 actually gets nerfed, I can see the Mini Uzi become the number one gun. The number one submachine gun, of course. Uh, I think MP7 comes close. But I feel like the Mini Uzi might take that spot as the number one. It's a really, really, really good pre-aim gun, man. Don't kill horror on my teammates. Oh my god, dude. I'm absolutely frying them with this gun right now. So this is a no recoil Uzi class. So obviously, it has really, really good range. The recoil control is insane. Just like a freaking beamer like that. But also, the Uzi is just good close up. And I do got some good attachments to make a good close up. Oh my god, this guy came off the top ropes. I used to believe that they're gonna hit the hill, but they're rotating. They're rotating. Step one guy so if they do like i said if they do nerf the mp5 i can see the uzi taking a spot the only other gun is maybe the mp7 uh the vector i used to think the vector is really good close up i'll give it that like it probably would be the best close up gun but thing is like in the competitive atmosphere like we take engagements like close range medium range long range and the vector's drop off is just so bad like it's so good close up but it's so weak far away like the mini Uzi and the MP7 was smoke this gun, so or smoke the vector. So I think the mini Uzi might be the gun. It's either the Uzi or the MP7. I don't know yet. We'll see. Teammate, don't shoot me, man. I'm kind of curious. Like, what do you? What would you guys want? Like, if there was another gun, like a different submachine gun. Let's say the meta were to supposed to were to change in a month. Uh, what would you your like your be? I can't even speak. What would your be your go to gun? Like, are you would you be a mini Uzi guy? Would you be an MP7 guy? Or would you be even like a like a P90 AUG? I don't know. Like, just leave down in the comments below what gun you would like to see. You know, be the main uh, submachine gun. Nice little beam sesh. But I'm on a merciless. I'm on a merciless. I'm gonna flank Silas. I get him off the hill here. He's not a contest spot. That's not good. Never do this play, by the way, guys. This is some really kill horse shit. Don't do this play ever. I just wanted to get him off the hill because he's pissing me off singing the hill so long. All right, I got smoke. And right now, there's only like two pro players using the uh, the mini Uzi and actual scrims and like competitive, uh, important ca uh, competitive things. Um, like, you know, I've used it before, like in like tens, eights and like freaking CDL playlists, but like actual like competitive atmosphere. Uh, there's like two or three pro players using it right now. Um, there's a chance we might see more as the game goes on or, you know, if, like I said, if they nerf the MP5, could help teammate. I don't know if you, if you hit them, but I just beamed them pretty bad. Open the door here. Hello, anybody want to come in home? No? Okay. You're not killing me this time, Holtz. No, I knew it. I sacrificed myself to get that kill. Guys, and a lot of my videos have been getting a thousand plus likes, man. It's been actually incredible. And I just want to say thank you so much for everyone leaving a like. Thank you so much, everyone, for the support. If you're one of those guys, let's keep doing it, man. Let's keep trying to hit a thousand plus likes every video if possible. Um, like I said, it's been pretty insane and I, I like I can't thank you guys enough man It really means a lot to me really the support is incredible like I said and just drop that like man drop that like on the video Oh, I completely missed Smash that like button share the video and you know if you want to go ahead subscribe to the channel as well Thank you come again. There's a guy in here and I'm gonna kill him now Aha get flash. What am I playing CS go? He's gonna spawn back left. I'm gonna spawn kill him for you guys. Okay? I would do this for nobody else, but except for you guys. I love you guys. Oh, no recoil. Mini Uzi. Oh, imagine I would have killed them too. The, I, eh. And I mentioned this in my Mini Uzi, like, couple, my Mini Uzi video a couple weeks ago, and I made it. 
how like the mini uzi the reason it's so good is the attachment oh my god that was a kobe from that guy uh the attachments it brings like the new attachments is a reason why it's even viable in the first place oh my god i almost hit on holtz uh, i was trying to get give payback for him shooting on me also as you guys know i usually leave the class setups at the end of the video now instead of the start of the video because i just want to showcase the gameplay um look at the memes baby I just want to showcase the gameplay. Obviously, if you guys care to watch, uh, enjoy the video, watch the video, you want to watch the whole thing. And then at the end, you know, enjoy the gameplay at the end. If you want another class, you can just uh, go look at the class. But yeah, some people can tell what the class is just by looking at the gun, which is pretty awesome. I can do, I can kind of do that now too, that I've played enough COD. He really hiding close left? Oh, God. Okay. Look at this rat. Look at him. Ha 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 ha. No, not today. Makes it easier for my team to get time, but they're not even getting any time. Holy shit. Here, I got hill, man. Let, let me let me let me make my stats look a little better. Holy shit, because I got no hill time. Here, I got some hill time, baby. Come on. Let me shine. Let me shine, baby. Let me get some triple doubles. You know what's so good about the Minuzi? It is it is a pre-aim beast. So like especially in like 60 hertz and like better lobbies. Obviously, this is a little bit more difficult to do it, but like if you pre-aim, like it will get it's hard to get cameraed when you use the mini Uzi. Oh, oh, I thought I fell off the map. No way. No, not today, buddy. Can I stay alive? Can I stay alive? Oh, no recoil, baby. You guys got to try this class out, man. On some serious shit, guys. You guys got to try this class out, man. Things are already in yellow. You know what's really sad about everything though? I haven't really talked about this much on my videos, but I low-key received a thumb injury uh, not too long ago. Like, I actually have a thumb injury right now. Um, it hurts to kind of grind and play. I'm trying to sort of, to, I'm trying to grind through it. Like, it hurts. And like, I'm really just trying to grind through it, but uh, we'll see how the, those things go, you know? Oh, one point, we need one point. And that's game. 55 kills. Damn. Holy. 55 and 15. Holy shit. Drop a like. We got some hack in the yard hard point. I am not hitting the hill. I'm hitting now mid, bro. Screw the hill. I hate this side. Did you guys know it's a stat that P2 It's actually the hardest hill to break? It's actually a stat that P2 hill is actually the hardest to break kind of saying to think about but that hill is just so easy to hold man my god let's go i flipped us baby second was it oh three piece second time's the charm third, third time's the charm whatever it is i don't i don't know the saying maybe leave in the comments below because i am a lost set like a solid oh barack just ran away from the hill eh? dude this gun bro all right listen guys quick tip Mini Uzi is a huge pre-fire gun and a pre-aim gun. So if you want to be good with it, like I said, make sure to hit some pre-fires, hit some pre-aims. Um, very essential. This is not a snappy type of gun. You can't just like, it can be good, like snappy, and like close up, like it can. But it's most dominant when you're pre-aiming and pre-firing. Oh my God, I'm absolutely having, oh my God. Somebody stop me, oh my God. Gonna kill you off the stack, Eddie. Kill you, beam you across the map. I just killed your teammate. Gonna throw a nade. Oh, hit him in the movement. Hit him in the movement. Oh, hit him in the movement. Oh, dude, the mini Uzi is an absolute shredder. Oh, we're getting out of hill. That's what we're doing. Man, it's not a bad play. It's a good play to have someone top. Look at that. Johnny even pulled out the mini Uzi. Oh, the shredder, the beamer, the Uzi. Uh, my teammates to sit around. They just like to sit around and do nothing, huh? And do absolutely nothing. Oh my god, the movement is so fluid. How do you deal with movement like that? Like how? Like how? You're just dead. You're just dead. It's so it's like a it's like a majestic unicorn. Dude, my teammates aren't actually moving. It's starting to piss me off. No, child the right! Okay, so I know how this goes. Basically, I need to win every rotation for my team. If not, we're going to lose because we do not know how to hit a hill or pressure a hill. So that's the only way we're going to win. Oh, no, he's on the back. I must have got left somewhere. 
Yep, oh. beamed you. Beamed you. See ya. See you later, Topo. Can we get some L control, man? Uh, there's one thing I don't like about CDL playlists. I don't like people who don't play objective and who don't play the hill. And if, yeah, Jump. sometimes, you know what? You know what? I don't play the hill. You're right. I play probably second least on my team or the least on my team. But there's a difference. I'm getting every kill on the map. I'm putting fucking hella pressure on the hill. Like, I'm doing shit. What really pisses me off is people who don't play the hill, right? They don't play the hill. And they just like, I don't care if you get smoked. Like, I'd rather you go die pushing a hill or challenging hill versus staying alive and getting getting useless kills or like not even helping win. That's actually really annoying. All right, I gotta go Donkey Kong here. I gotta, I gotta flip up. I gotta flip us. Oh my God. I'm on Donkey Kong. I'm on Donkey Kong. I'm telling you, bro, the only way we're gonna win is if I get rotation for my team. We don't have rotation, we're not winning. Holy shit, I had to go Donkey Kong just to get rotation. Oh, top right? What are we watching? All right, we just need to hit one good rotation in here, P1 Hill. Come on, let's all rotate. I know it's it's kind of not in your fucking, it's not in your dictionary. Rotate, what is that? But we gotta hit some rotations here. Uh, they should be all L side. Bottom L right now, to bottom L. Got the other one, name top L. Let's go, baby, we win it right here. That was a terrible name, by the way. Oh, no, I got stuck. Oh my God, I, I got, no, that's not good. I have my hop at least. My teammates flanked. How's this guy on the hill? No, we got flank. Let's go. I told you, baby. I win rotations. We win it. Donkey Kong. 48 and 16. What is that? A 3.0? Holy shit. 3.0. Okay, day. Let's go. All right, guys. So this is the Uzi class. I was running the no recoil Uzi. Got the compensator commando combo. I've said this many times. Best combo for recoil control. Got the carbine pro. It's a must. Got the 41 AE 32 round mags. It's a must. Now, this is where it gets tricky. I went to close quarter stock. I was trying stippled grip tape, but for some reason, stippled felt so weird close up. I felt like I wasn't as loose as I could could have been. So, like, I felt like close up engagements were kind of hard sometimes. So, I switched to close quarter stock, and it felt a lot better. So, I, I think this is the best one. You can obviously experiment. I think this is the one attachment you can change. The other four are must on a no, no recoil Uzi class. You can use no stock instead of close quarter stock, but the thing is, it gives you recoil control. It, it, or it takes away recoil control so you don't want that honestly so the options are either close quarter stock or stippled grip tape guys i hope you enjoyed today's video make sure to smash that like button i appreciate all the support in the videos on my channel don't forget to subscribe to the channel and comment down below what is your favorite submachine gun i'll see you guys later peace out